Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's video. We're going to be taking a look at how to activate the dev branch on your Arma 3 account. The dev branch, for those of you who do not know, allows you to play the experimental version of the game, which gets content as soon as the devs create it. It's where they put all their content whenever they need to test it. And they also have it open to the public, so that way they have people to test the content and point out flaws in it. So it's very simple to set up, and I'll have a few important things to note here at the end of the video. Let's go ahead and get into the main part of this. So you're going to open up your Steam, go to your library, you're going to find Arma 3, right click on it, and you're going to go to Properties. From there, you're going to go to Betas, you're going to select Development, or Development, Development Build, and then hit Close, and that's it. The game should start to update. And then once it has updated, you are in the development build. Now, important, or a few important things to note. One, you cannot have both versions of the game at one time. So if you switch to the development mode, it'll have to install that. Whenever you switch back, it's going to have to uninstall that content and potentially install extra stuff to go back to the original version. A lot of different mods and scripts and community made items do not work on the dev branch. And you cannot play normal servers running full released versions of the game. So it greatly limits what you have access to in multiplayer. You can only play multiplayer servers that are also running the dev branch. Uh, that's really everything you know about this. I hope you guys found this helpful, and I will see you in the next guide.